everyone, I'm Anne from Anne Makes. Welcome to my channel. Uh, this is a Dollar Tree haul video that I have for you today. And this is my fourth video that I am filming in a row. I went to two Dollar Ramas and two Dollar Trees this week. And uh, I've been, I filmed each haul uh, separately because I thought it would be way too long a video. And so this is the fourth and the final one of this uh, this the shopping little shopping spree I went on not really a shopping spree I just haven't had much opportunity to go shopping in the dollar stores or any store for that matter recently I've just had a lot of uh, other obligations and deadlines to meet in my work so it, my time has been limited uh, but anyway I needed to go because I needed a few items and I, of course I, I got stuff that I don't really need but that I want so here we go. Uh, I got a, a few packages of the, <clears throat> excuse me, I got a few packages of the chopping mats. They're they have two of these chopping mats. Uh, they're, they're not transparent, but close. And I use these in my craft carts, the carts on wheels that I got from uh, Michael's and you get them from Ikea and Costco even has one now. I put those in the bottom. So anything, if there's stuff that drips from the top, it just, it doesn't drip down to the bottom supplies or pencils don't follow through, stuff like that. So I use these and um, I needed some more. I didn't have enough to cover all my shelves. So I got a few of these. <clears throat> I like picking up the packages of white poster board at Dollar Tree. I think they're a very good deal. They're they're nice poster board. They're they're nice size to work with, and you they're 11 by 14, and you get five in a package for Dollar Twenty Five. So that's pretty pretty decent. Uh, although technically it is spring, that's what it says on the calendar. We have a ton of snow left. Uh, Thankfully, we've had some rain. It's melted a lot of that snow, and a lot of snow, again, is melting today. It is warm outside. It's actually foggy today. We've had a fog alert. It's, it, the visibility is really, really bad right now on the roads, but in, in just this area. Um, and But it's like there's still so much snow. I ha There's no way I'm gonna see my spring flowers in spring, I think. So when I saw these at the Dollar Tree, I said, oh, I'm gonna get these and I'm gonna plant them inside my house so I can bring a little bit of springtime in my house. Um, the garden centers in this area are not open yet, um, obviously because there is too much snow. It's just, you can't even drive onto the parking lots. They're just full of snow, so they're not even open yet. Uh, local stores barely have any kind of plants or flowers so uh, I just you know what I said I'm not gonna bother driving uh, 45 minutes to find real flowers I'm just gonna buy these at Dollar Tree and make a lovely little arrangement uh, for uh, myself so I got these I like they have this big bulb showing and I kind of feel like Uh, dangling this in front of the squirrels noses here since they always eat my real ones here chew on this <laughs> I mean <laughs> and I had seen Tina uh, Kazarian uh, haul these and I thought they looked really good they look pretty real uh, up close they they look fake but they they're, they're not bad they're a good imitation actually of uh, lavender so, and I do have lavender that grows in my garden. I don't, the lavender I have in my garden, well, actually, yeah, I think all lavender only blooms in like July or something, but um, I just thought these were really cute and they would be practical for any kind of project I have. Any kind of project I have that requires little flowers. As you may already have guessed, uh, I love licorice, so I always buy my Twizzlers at the Dollar Tree, except for the extra long ones that I got at Dollarama. So these I get a Dollar Tree. Oh, I was happy to see a lemon, a real lemon lemon, because uh, like this week we had fish and uh, we couldn't, get, we, there weren't any decent lemons at the store, but we got limes. And it was delicious with the lime, but it would 
It would have been nice to have lemon juice. So when I saw that, I said, oh, this will do in a pinch. Uh, there were, this was new on the shelves at the Dollar Tree I went to. Um, the Max Block After Sun Soothing Gel. It's aloe vera. This is great, people, for... Uh, if you get a, of course, if you get a sunburn, that's what it's intended for. Uh, it's after sun, but I've also used this in an emergency situation because I have burned my hands very badly with hot glue, and uh, this has been my saving grace. So I just, when I saw this at uh, the Dollar Tree, and I hadn't seen this in a long time, I picked up two tubes because this is great to have in the pharmacy exactly for that if you do get a burn. And there's also some craft use uh, that I learned about when I was at Creativation, uh, they, that this was being used as some sort of resist. I, I don't have all the details, I haven't tried it yet, but I thought, oh, I'm gonna keep one in my, my studio because that's where I'm likely to burn myself anyway. And the other one I'll keep with our pharmaceutical products. I bought some hand soap. I, I just keep buying the same ones. It's just easy for me to grab the same bottles every time I go to the store. Uh, the Clara and Danver Ocean Fresh for the boys bathroom. And oh, I was in need of D batteries. So I picked these up. A package of three D batteries. And now come to think of it, I need four. And they come in a pack of three. Back to the store I go. <laughs> uh, in my previous Dollar Tree haul video, I showed you that I hauled a couple of these. And I said I had hauled four more at the other store, but I, I, I was wrong. There was only three, so I, I have five of these, and I actually needed six. So, um, yeah. Anyway, but these are the little trolley trays to put under planters. They're great, so they, they you could wheel like a heavy potted plant around, the flowers around. So this will be handy uh, come summertime outside on my patio. Oh, I saw the uh, Aileen's Original Tacky Glue, and I was really happy because I do use this glue a lot. I love using this glue, and uh, for a dollar twenty-five for three fluid ounces. That's pretty good. That's a that's a good price actually. So I bought a few bottles of that to keep in my stash just because it's something that I use a lot of. So I was happy to to finally find that at my Dollar Tree. I've seen so many people haul them and they never that glue never came to my store. And now it finally has. Uh, this is a tin that has a metallic um, magnetic back, so it can stick to a refrigerator or in the case I use it in my studio on my metal craft carts. And I I do use these in the kitchen too for uh, refrigerator magnets or uh, other doodads and even spices. Uh, well, I use the smaller ones. Uh, but I, I wanted this to use on my craft cart. And I was a little bummed because afterwards when I went to, one, to a Dollarama, I saw they had slightly smaller versions in a two pack for the same price. So, but yeah, these are bigger. So, yeah, ends up. It's kind of good to compare between stores. Oh, I saw these cute little bunny erasers, and I think other people have hauled these, and I didn't see them except this this one time that I went in this Dollar Tree, and so I got these. I just thought they're so cute. They're so adorable. And, um, yeah, they're great for Easter. They're great for loot bags, Easter baskets. They're great little gifts. They're great craft embellishments. <laughs> There's so many things you can do with these. And so they're erasers, but I'm not going to eat. They're too cute to use up as erasers. This is new uh, at the Dollar Tree. Uh, April Bath and Shower Moisturizing Foot Mask. I don't know how, uh, how this works, if it works well or what. I'm sure it's it's pretty good. Then I think you get the little socks in there and the lotion to wear on your feet. And I think uh, this might be good to 
to do because my feet are very dry, you know, it's winter and stuff. Yeah. So and I thought if if I like this, I'll I'll bring some more in my suitcase for my next trip because let me tell you when I'm do it on a business trip and I do so much walking. At the end of the day I'm really my feet are really tired, so they, they need a little pampering. Um these were the only ones that were there, and they were a little curved, but I took them anyway. They are these wooden inspirational stickers, and I really love the hot air balloon one. And although they were a little curved, I still took them um, because I really like them. And um, this, this one says creative, and it's just really cute. And so they're 3D. Uh, you get six pieces in here for... Uh, your dollar twenty-five because by the way uh, I'm in Canada so the Dollar Trees here uh, the items cost us a dollar twenty-five Canadian. I saw these packages of reusable wipes. I've seen them before, and I never really paid attention. And they say they're heavy duty uh, for hard to clean jobs. Use it says use these heavy duty reusable wipes for all your hard to clean jobs. So I guess instead of using um, paper towels it says simply rinse and use over and over um, I've never tried these if anybody else has let me know what you think I just thought they would be worth a try because you know there's a lot it's spring it, it's, it's supposed to be spring anyway and we're you know on the weekends we're doing little little jobs around the house you know getting ready for summer and we're going through paper towels and rags and stuff, so just thought I'd give these a try. I've seen many people haul these. I had not seen them at my uh, local Dollar Tree, but this Dollar Tree that I went to this week, not demon, and so I'm gonna try them. Uh, they are the Honey O's bag of cereal, and I thought, well, other people have said they're really good, and I'll, I'm willing to uh, give these a try. My boys do like to eat cereal in the morning, or just as a snack sometimes, so um, we'll try this and we'll see how we like it. Uh, the Dollar Tree I was at had these nice uh, solar steak lights with the stone, kind of gray stone finish. So I picked uh, several up. I picked up several of these to have uh, for my own garden. And yep, yeah, so got those. And I got like twelve of those. So the bag is full. And oh, so I have a bag full of these solar steak lights and cookies. So this is the last item I have to show you. Uh, blueberry bars. Um, this is a repurchase uh, of ours because we, we love snacking on these. And that's that. I, I thought I would have a lot more to show you, but I forgot that I have 12 of the same items. So, yeah, that's why the bag is so big. Uh, so thank you so much for watching. I hope you liked this video. And uh, if you did, I would so appreciate a like, a thumbs up. Please comment, uh, share. And subscribe if you're not already subscribed. And just to give you an idea, one of the products I've been working on lately are these cute little paper flowers. And that's why my uh, my Cricut is open and my studio is a mess right now because I'm doing a lot of, uh, I have a lot of deadlines to meet. I have a lot of projects to work on. So I better get to work because I, yeah, I got to, I got to do it. Thanks a lot for watching. Take care of yourself. Bye. Mm -hmm.